main thing is I think just being confident in yourself, um, understanding that everybody's here is here for a reason, um, and never to doubt yourself or uh, think that you know um, that you lack something that somebody else might hold or is capable of. Uh, definitely just believing in yourself. Like there's there's not a defense out there that I, I, I don't understand because the. Uh, our defense was so complex and so like, you know, ver 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 versatile that like you can basically place me in any type of defense and it kind of it becomes easier than what I, whatever I played in. So and especially as as a Mike, like there was like so many different defenses, so many different things we played, you know, so many different three down, four down, directional, formational, all those things, uh, middle field open, middle field close. That like everything I go into it kind of becomes a whole lot easier. You can just play a little faster. I think I showcased my leadership, showcased um my quickness, fast. Uh, my quickness as a linebacker and IQ as a linebacker, and just my ability to lead out on the field. You know, like I said, my nutrition plan, uh, my maintenance program with Justin Smith back in NC State. You know, just understanding what it takes to play a whole season. I think when I was young, I was still in my high school mind. You know, just playing ball on Saturday and then living my life. And you know, that's not who I am anymore. So you know, just putting it all in. Everything that I do is for the Lord and for football. So. Yeah, I mean, I think the Senior Bowl was a huge opportunity um, to kind of compete with the best players um, in the country. And I feel like, you know, I came out of that feeling like I competed very, very well. Um, so it was a huge honor to be there, um, to meet guys, learn from NFL coaches um, at the Senior Bowl. So it was definitely a great experience. Yeah, man, just uh, taking control of the defense. You know, um, like you said, being a quarterback of the defense, you got a lot on your plate, a lot of responsibility. And I think uh, the main thing is just being, making sure you're prepared all the time. Um, and, you know, not, not really thinking about making mistakes and just, you know, being fast uh, and being assertive. You know, uh, when you get in the room, you got to be loud. You got to be confident. You got to make you got to make them think that what you're saying is right. And um, and almost like being a coach. So, you know, learning that and being comfortable doing that as a Mike linebacker is something I've been able to do. I think that it's more about like what, what are you willing to sacrifice to for the bigger goals? Like you put in all those work. If I can't achieve that so like you know I'm gonna give it all I got until I can't anymore I would say just to enjoy the process really I mean it goes by so quite uh, quickly and uh, it's something that not everyone can go through and that everyone really dreams to to be here um, so just really to enjoy the process and enjoy be where your feet are and uh, just go from there yeah, so at NC State, I played Will. Um, you know, that's kind of how our defense was set up. It was ran through the Will linebacker and the free safety. But, you know, in the NFL, you know, I would love to play either Mike or Will. I'd love to have a Mike in my helmet taking control of a defense. But if I play a Will linebacker spot, I think I'm really good in space. Um, I think it's something that I do really well, and I think the tape shows that. So either or, whatever team needs me, wherever they want me to go, I'm going to go try to be great at it. For me, uh, the team is everything, uh, you know, uh, I, I come from a culture, a school where, you know, th the team was the main priority and a lot of us had to sacrifice, you know, the things we wanted to put the team's goals ahead and we were able to accomplish big things doing that. So, Yeah, I definitely like that weak side seek and destroy position. I think that plays right into my play style. Um, I feel like I'm a very sideline to sideline linebacker. I have good speed, athleticism. Um, so I think that does just play right into my play style. I wouldn't say it's overwhelming. I would say it's just kind of... Uh, it's more like a, you know, like a job interview. If you treat it like that, I don't really think it gets overwhelming. Um, I think it's actually like, you know, putting yourself up to the, to the plate and doing something that you've been preparing for your whole life, and you finally get to, you know, um, show everything you've been preparing for to the other teams, the other scouts, other other people. Ever since I, I stepped on the football field, it was like I always wanted to be the best. I feel like whatever you put your name to, whatever you put you, you lay down, you always want to try to be the best at it, or or why 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 even try to do it at all. Yeah, so I think for the most part, um, teams see me as an inside guy, but the teams have definitely um, talked to me about being an outside uh, and inside, just being able to play both, uh, being able to be versatile in that, in that aspect. Yeah, so I, uh, I would say the main thing is just uh, learning small details um, about teams that might give you an edge. Uh, some, sometimes, you know, you want to be faster than the offense themselves are, so I think once you kind of repeat, uh, repeatedly watch over things on film and you start to get a, a feel for how they might play on the field, um, you're, not really, uh, you're not really, you know, shocked or caught as surprised when they do certain things and it helps you play fast, play confident, uh, play physical. Yeah, I love being able to rush the passer. Um, it was great being able to rush the passer. It was always fun. Uh, every time I was on the edge, I had a lot of fun doing it. Uh, being able to play the run or, or even drop from the edge spot, it was, it was, there's a lot of things you could really do and I, I, th I thought it was just, Pretty similar to inside backer, just from the line of scrimmage. 
I mean, I'm not going to put a specific number out there, but I think that they're going to be really good. Um, I think I think that uh, when you turn on the tape, you see some speed, you see some athleticism. So I'm just excited to go prove to everyone that it's true.